All right, guys, welcome back to another video of Shaman J. Will. So if you haven't heard, T-Mobile is about to drop a bombshell uh, with uh, Sprint. I, I spoke of this before, and they are getting ready to join together. They were in their final stages um, last week uh, when I did a live stream, and here uh, I looked on social media, and boom, I think as of Sunday is when they actually talked about it publicly together. You'll see both CEOs together. So just head over to Twitter and look at John Ledger's Twitter account. And you will see the video there. of them talking about how they're going to change the industry together uh, and they're going to join together. Now, whether this is an official news or not, um, whether it's official, if it's been signed off on and, and they've been given the go-ahead, I'm thinking they probably, I don't think they would go public like this uh, if they haven't already gotten everything taken care of. Now, one thing to consider. Uh, they're, they're saying in this video that they're going to give more jobs. Uh, they're going to do more for the industry. Uh, and, you know, they're just going to enhance everything, especially with 5G. Now, John Ledger talks about Sprint's 2.5G network. Um, and, you know, he's excited about what their networks are going to do together and how they're going to mix well together. You know, I, I told a few people last week, you know, this, this is probably going to happen. I knew they were in their final stages. Uh, however, I didn't know that they were actually going to make an announcement. Uh -huh. So maybe it's already finalized at the recording of this video when you're watching it. Uh, but, um, you know, what do you guys think about T-Mobile merging together with Sprint? Now, I said in my live stream that I'm hoping that they merge together. At first, the first two or three times this was coming about, I wasn't a fan of it. Now I'm a fan of it because Project Fi. Google, if you're listening, you need to capitalize with this move with your Project Fi. Because Google F Project Fi currently runs on T-Mobile and Sprint. So this means an onslaught of phones that we could have if T-Mobile and Sprint join together. Predominantly, you'd be able to get a Pixel probably with ease now. Pixel 2, Pixel 2 XL. Uh, you can probably get a ton of phones. The Moto X4 line can go to carriers. It, it could be just a great thing if these guys decide to officially join together or, 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 you know, it's written off as, okay, so go ahead. This will take T-Mobile up to about 127 million subscribers uh, with uh, AT&T Next at 140 and then Verizon at 150. Now, what I see happening is people leaving AT&T for sure. Verizon uh, customers, from my experience of talking to them, they just think they're getting the best deal. Uh, but I don't think so because, you know, Verizon's bills, I'm a Verizon customer at one point myself. Uh, and I, I've been with all carriers, by the way. And uh, Verizon's bills are ridiculously high priced. Um, and they don't offer much at all. They still charge you line access fees, which is just horrible. Uh, but depending on what plan you're in, especially if you only want one phone, Verizon is not the way to go. If you just want one or two phones, it's definitely not the way to go. It's very expensive uh, and you don't have unlimited data with that. Uh, however, I, I foresee a lot of people leaving AT&T and Verizon coming in and switching to T-Mobile, I think by in the next two years, if in fact Sprint and T-Mobile are officially together, by then T-Mobile will be uh, probably in second place. Uh, not that that matters to me, but I think they're going to easily pass AT&T uh, if they're at 140 million and T-Mobile's at 127 million as of 2018. I think by 2020, T-Mobile's going to be in first or second. They're going to be the number one carrier, or you know they're going to be as far as numbers go, not not network. I'm not saying that T-Mobile's network is great. It's definitely not great on its own. I've demoed this before, but joining with Sprint, we, they might be on to something here. I think this is a positive move. Uh, I'm all for it, and you know I hope that that it, it is official. And I know they put out a video together, but from that video, there's a lot of disclaimers. If you scroll up, you'll see a lot of disclaimers. So, when in fact they do uh, join together, Google. I need you to step in and I need you to take charge of this with devices because F Project Fi can be huge. If Project Fi had unlimited data, oh boy, look out. Which in turn, you can definitely make that uh, connection with T-Mobile and Sprint. This could be a good thing, folks. So it's your man, Jay Will. Sprint and T-Mobile are going to be one or they're already one, depending on when you watch this video. What do you guys think? Leave a comment down below and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.